Well, they work to bring smiles to children across the country and right here in our area with facial deformities and fight human trafficking. Now they're holding a special event of father daughter dance. Susan Matthews, the co-founder of Love Without Reason and Brian Smith, the chair of the father daughter dance join me now. Thank you both so much for being here. Thanks. Thank you. Susan, let's start by talking about, of course, over the years, I've gotten to know you and just the incredible work that you do with Love Without Reason, but remind people of what Love Without Reason is and how you got started. Well, we started the organization actually 16 years ago uh, because of the journey that we had with our firstborn son, uh, Philip Matthews. Um, he lived for 19 years. Who was a wonderful <laughs> young man who I got to know, Philip. Yes, yes, yes. And uh, he went through 25 surgeries, uh, most of them craniofacial. And we were just fortunate that we had everything we needed, every resource to help him here in Chattanooga. But we understood that if he had been born in a different country, if he had been born in the developing world, uh, those resources would not have been available to him. Mm -hmm. And that's the reason we started Love Without Reason. Uh, Philip inspired us and as we started the organization we learned that these children just because they're born with a different face they are sold into human trafficking networks it could be for sex it could be for labor it could be for child beggary or even for their organs and so when we are able to provide their surgeries for free that is actually changing the whole course of their life so doing that's how they link. More, like we said, we say bringing a smile, but it's doing so much more. <laughs> um, Brian, let's talk about this. You are the chair of the Father Daughter Dance yes. um, to benefit Love Without Reason. Talk a little bit about, you have an 11, and we have to say half. Yep, she's 11 and a half now. 11 so. and a half. Okay, so tell us about this event. So I'm here to represent dads that are uh -huh. out there. We, we know this is a wonderful cause, uh -huh. so I'm kind of looking at all the moms and grandmas that are out there watching mm -hmm. because this is a wonderful night for dads and daughters of all ages to mm -hmm. come. We're not just talking about 11-year-olds and 2-year-olds. We're talking all ages and grandfathers and uncles that can participate in this. And also, too, for dads, you know, it's a very special night and evening mm -hmm. to just hang out with your daughter and for daughters out there it's the world uh -huh. and you know, i've been to the dance a couple years ago with them happy to be part of uh, uh, this wonderful event this year as well and addison at home She's already dress shopping right now. It's <laughs> of a course she wonderful is. night. So of course she is. Details, Lots of pressure, Dad. Yeah, I know, I know. I, I'm like trying to figure out what I'm going to wear, and I'm like, hey, not me. So, but February 9th at the Embassy Suites over by Hamilton Place, we got some great handhelds for Ruth Chris. We've got a dessert table that kids will love that. Uh, photography, the DJ. And, I mean, just an absolutely wonderful evening. And and that, that's what means the world to me is that I told Addison we're going. She's happy. It's her special night but for the adults that are participating in this we know it's for a great cause too it really is for a great cause and it really is and when you talk about that that father daughter relationship as someone who is still like a daddy's girl so yeah. you know i mean it really is and so to be able to go out and take your and i love seeing pictures when dads go out with their daughters yeah. and it just really is because it teaches those young girls so much about you know how men should treat them and and it really is special with dad susan one of the things too so i know you're great grateful to have brian chair this event <laughs> and you know he's so excited about this yes. event and you know to get dads and daughters out there but just like you said the big picture of what you all are doing yes um, you know we, we talk about dads and daughters like you said the relationship um, it's it's beautiful to see some of our patients uh, that's what we were talking about you know what we're doing here is actually benefiting another dad mm -hmm. and his daughter you know who is struggling a dad who's struggling a daily wage worker mm -hmm. who's struggling to provide surgery for his child I mean it's going to change their family and that family can change the community and that community can change the world and it's the same for us here so it's just going to be a, a wonderful night with a wonderful cause well, again, we want to invite everyone to come out, and so give us that date and time again and location, Absolutely. Brian. So to all the moms out there watching, tell your husbands, <laughs> all right, because I know how this works. So the event's going to be February the 9th. Tickets are still available. We're trying to double the amount of uh, participants we had last year, so we're hoping to get a good 150, 200 uh, couples to be out there. Uh, if you have multiple daughters, bring them all. So it is February 9th, 6.30 p.m. at the Embassy Suites, lovewithoutreason.org. We'll show that here in a second. But, but remember, dads out there, it's also doing this for your daughter. She's going to love it. She's going to have a great time because remember, 
you're her first love. That is right. I love that. Mm -hmm. That is so sweet. And of course, just for all the great work, you know how much I admire the work that you do, thank Susan, you. here with Love Without Reason. And Brian, thank you so much for being here. No 